Cole is an amazing, like, really good athlete. Yeah. Um, so here we go, starting round one. Janelle oh, right Stevens comes deck. out crazy right away. Tying up in the clinch. Again, Shamimi just, oh, spinning back fist. Now the question is, is this a sustainable, is this a sustainable brawl? You know? Well, it's I mean, both girls want to establish their dominance. That's, that has a lot to do with it. I know it's not the type of fight that Nicole chooses, chooses to have. Um, Janelle is definitely much more the aggressor right now. Whoa, nice big right hand that lands from Janelle. Shamimi looking to kind of establish her dominance as well, kind of calm Janelle down, stop that onslaught, pace got, the pacing. She's got to keep active with the jab um, and step outside because, yeah, Janelle's starting to... Well, here's the thing about Janelle. She knows that she's long and rangy, and she actually knows how to use it. Yep. You know, she will use a long jab and a long cross when she has the opportunity. Right now, you see she's very comfortable in the clinch as well, showing her control, showing her use of uh, dominance here. Shamimi, who also has excellent hands and combinations, is having a hard time with that reach. She gets in, throws. Shamimi with the body lock. Wagner breaks them up. We have, we have a brawler against what usually is a more technical fighter. Yeah. And uh, like I said, we're in the first round. I think the gas tank is going to figure this one out. Woo! Like I said, it's a super arsenal. Oh, big, big, big right, right hand, hand that lands. By Janelle. And Shamimi landing some knees there. Shamimi showing her control in the clinch, throwing Janelle off balance. Chris Wagner says no, a hip throw, not legal. Yeah, again, you can you cannot lift your opponent up off the canvas. Oh, she is getting much more aggressive with it. And she's decided to meet Janelle. Oh, that most quite like long range, that those long arms of Janelle. Very, very hard to be on the end of those. The gaps in that right hand though on Janelle. She leaves that right hand out there. Nice body kick. And, and the hands, Janelle coming the in. The hands so are off starting balance. to drop. So again, you, you know, you can't turn your back, so Wagner breaks them up. Another right hand by Janelle. Shmimi does is she, she ties up Janelle's hands when she's in the clinch. Janelle doing the right thing though. As soon as you get out of it, she's throwing. And the hands are dropping again, like we said. Janelle is getting tired. She's starting. Shmimi has to capitalize on this right now. She's going to make it in Spinning back fist. Janelle tries to throw her own. And those knees have been taken out of the gas tank. Great throw from Janelle. Yeah, just, just she's got nine fights and one loss. Janelle having four fights and zero losses. Shmimi's actually been a little bit more active. Uh, in fighting, but Janelle just, you know, being rangier, being fast. They're, they're, they're both just really going for Janelle it. Janelle gets the throw.
I mean, they're really brawling here. You can see, like, it, it, once they get into the clinch position, neither one wants to let the other one uh, have it. Nice right hand by Shamimi. Big stiff jab by Janelle. Big right hand from Janelle. Another big Amen. right hand from Janelle. I'd like to see Janelle follow that right hand with some kicks while she has uh, Shamimi slightly off balance. Janelle's just really coming forward with her boxing now. Good lighting. With Janelle ha having her hand on the inside trying to get her hand into the dominant head position. Now Shamimi has the body lock. What she's doing is she's not letting Janelle land uh, any really big knees or clean knees. And just out pointing her. Nice leg kick. Yeah, Janelle just using that right hand, just trying to find that right hand. Shamimi knowing that, that she has that longer range, goes in for the clinch position. Just, they're just going for it. Everything they got to end the round. Oh, big, big stiff jab land. Shamimi coming in for the clinch, throws a big knee, another knee. Now going for the cross box. Woo! Wow, two very, very tough competitors. Shamimi, very fit though, looks like she could totally go another round. Absolutely. Definitely one of my favorite fighters here in New York. A well-conditioned athlete. Yeah, well-conditioned athlete. Janelle also just knowing her range, knowing yep. that she has those longer arms and those longer punches, utilizing them. Um, you know, and trying to capitalize off that all three rounds. So uh, uh, let's see. Let's see what the judges decide. Gavin? Um, it's, this is going to be a tough one. Um, Janelle came out gaming off the first round. Yeah. And into the second round. The second round, you started to see the, the gas tank start to get low, energy levels waned. And Shamimi in the second round said, okay, I'll meet you on your field and started brawling. Um, now it could get down to the conditioning of Shamimi or just the pure just tenacity of, of Janelle. Um, this will be an interesting call. Yeah. I would really like to see Janelle with a little more experience down the line, say six to six months to a year, a couple more fights in her belt. Oh yeah, like you I know? said, you know, Shamimi has nine nine fights, one loss, and then this is Janelle's fifth fight. Yep. Uh, she has four wins, has never lost, so you know, we'll see. She definitely has a bright future ahead of her, I will say that. Hope we're taking a break. I know. We worked with them for the last like six months. Uh, six weeks. Federation President Brian Crenshaw in to present the belt. Yes, this is for the WKA Amateur Lightweight title. As you can see why these girls are working so hard. Yep. Ladies and gentlemen, let's get a nice round of applause out here for both of these fighters. After three rounds of action here at the Skylight Modern, we go to the judges' scorecards, and they read as follows. Judge A, 29 to 28 for Shamami. Judge C scores this bout 30 to 29 for Stevens. 
And Judge P scores this bout 29-28 for your winner by split decision and the new WKA Amateur State Lightweight Champion, Janelle Stevens! I definitely see a rematch here. Yep. I mean, I, I think Janelle won uh, because of that just vicious and long right hand that, you know, landed clear so many times. But I know that Shamimi uh, is going to go home and try to figure out how to deal with this long-rangey fighter, and it would be a, a, a good fight.